So this is a very interesting question. The telemetry monitor technician notifies the nurse of the morning telemetry reading. He says, hey, here's what we have. Who are you going to see first? So patient number one, client number one says, the client is in normal sinus rhythm. Excellent. But keep reading. With a peak or a tall T wave. I don't know if you remember at the beginning of the class, we talked about electrolyte imbalance and EKG changes. And we talked about a tall or peak T wave what is that indicative of or, or, or what could be the problem hyperkalemia so you have to say is an is a high or peak t wave expected in normal sinus rhythm no so there is something else going on here so number one i'm going to leave it as a possible answer number two atrial fibrillation with a rate of 100 that is expected it's not a very high heart rate now if we have Atrial fibrillation with a rapid ventricular response. That is another problem. So number two is expected. One is winning right now. Three, the client was diagnosed with myocardial infarction. When? We don't know that. We don't know when it was. Three days ago, five days ago, last week, last month. When was it? We don't know. The patient now has occasional PVCs, premature ventricular contraction. So... One thing that we know is that in patients that's, that have had myocardial infarction, it is common for them to experience PVCs. Three, we have to monitor very careful, but we have to compare which one is the worst. PVCs that are expected after a myocardial infarction or signs of hyperkalemia with a tall or peak T wave. One, is more unstable than three. It's not saying that the patient is having an active MI. You have to be careful with that. In between one and three, one is more unstable. This is expected. This is unexpected. So we're going to eliminate three using SAR method. Four, first degree AV block and a heart rate of 92. For the most part, a first degree heart block is usually asymptomatic and there is no intervention. So four is not the most unstable. The answer is one.